One local San Diego business owner is kind of branching out, if you will, a company joining a company to help individuals struggling with substance abuse. Dr. Megan Mc Johnson McCullough, Dr. Megan Johnson McCullough, here to talk about her new project titled Mindful Bodies. Last time we chatted, you were a natural bodybuilder doing your thing, right? Yes. And you were also running a gym, helping people get fit. Yes. But now you're branching out. Could uh, talk a little bit about that. Earlier this year, I was given the opportunity to uh, become an owner of a business called Mindful Rejuvenation, which is now under my ownership called Mindful Bodies, which is behavioral outpatient discovering yourself. So it's a substance abuse addiction treatment center, which aligns with all of my research studies using exercise as medicine um, to help persons in recovery. So I'm branching out and the studio next to it just opened up, so I'm moving everybody's fit next to Mindful Bodies. So you keep them all in, under one watchful eye. Yeah. All right, so talk to us a little bit about, because you're a bodybuilder, but you also went to school to get that DR in front of your name, and what did you learn specifically in your book knowledge that makes you think that you can help people with addiction? Well, from my personal experiences losing my mother to alcoholism, that's where my passion and foundation started of combining my expertise in exercise. So through research has proven and shown that exer exercise is beneficial to persons struggling with uh, substance abuse problems. So I did my research on the influence of exercise on alcohol use disorder. And from that, you know, I've learned a lot. My research got studied, uh, got published into a textbook. And so it just kind of all aligns. And I think that owning this new business kind of makes all of that education worth it. And it's just the culmination of everything I've worked yeah, for. Yeah, you, you've come, you've put it all together. Right. It's, it's coming together for you. So I, I congratulate you on taking something, a, a passion, and turning it into a business. Thank you. You're, you're never going to work a day in your life, even though I know you work <laughs> like a dog to, uh, to keep both businesses going. Uh, so how do people find you as far as, does, do they have to be referred to you via a doctor? Or how do you, or can people just off the street who feel like they're dealing with some serious issues come in and work out with you? So we offer different levels depending on where you are in your recovery journey. So there's partial hospitalization, int intensive outpatient, just outpatient programs, um, medication assisted, telehealth is available. We're one of the only LGBTQ plus friendly locations. So we accept community and diversity. And basically you can go on our website, mindfulbodies.com, or you can call and you can fill out an intake form. From there, we might uh, be able to figure out if your insurance um, applies to our location and our facility. If not, we will refer you to somewhere that might be able to help you because we do want you to get help. And from there, um, we'll decide the best course of action for a comprehensive treatment program for you that's tailored to your individual needs. And uh, if you're not covered by insurance, you can, of course, pay out of pocket. So it just depends on what your particular needs are that our staff, we have Jacqueline Ortega, who runs the administration, Elliot, Lupita, we have a nurse, Lily, and two doctors. And so they will use their expertise and knowledge to direct you as best they can. So this is all firing up on Saturday? What's happening is this week, I literally got off a plane from Illinois. I had a bodybuilding competition yeah. and I moved my studio. So, that so being here is a break from moving. Oh. And then I go right back there after. So the studio has been totally shifted to right next door. And so we're doing kind of a re-grand opening on Saturday so that everyone can see my new location, but also Mindful Bodies because all of my clients who are wonderful and incredible are all following me. And I feel really blessed for that. It brings tears to my eyes. And so I want them to see the inside of that facility as well. Um, because during the week when they're coming and working out, you know, we can't really interrupt right. uh, the treatments that's right. taking place. It. So it's a chance for everyone in Oceanside to see it too. Um, people have watched me as a little girl get to come, right. you know, see what it's all about. And it's so rad because it's, you can see the beach I'm across the street from the Museum of Art, City Hall. So I really feel like it's taken, I've had that studio for 12 years, Paul, and it's I've worked so hard to be at this new spot and I feel blessed to be here now and share that with everyone because, uh, you know, there are people out there that the reason I created this name, Everybody, is because 
I want to help every body become the best version of themselves. So on that, let's. That's the best soundbite right there. We'll okay. stop right there. <laughs> Megan, I wish you continued success. I've watched you from the basketball court to this to being an entrepreneur, and I, I hope uh, it really works out for you because okay. I, I know you're all about helping people, and that's what that's really cool.